everybody. Welcome back to another awesome day, another awesome vlog. We are back at Disneyland. We're in Tomorrowland and we are right next to the Astro Orbiter. I've learned some really interesting information about this ride recently. This ride actually opened in 1956 and it was located just over by the submarines. At that time it was called the Astro Jets. It sat in that location for 10 years and it was originally made to look like a traveling carnival ride. This is what the Astro Jets looked like in 1956. In 1966, the ride was actually renovated and relocated right up there on top of the People Mover waiting area. It actually was renamed to the Rocket Jets at that time and it stayed in that location from 1967 to 1997. This is what the Rocket Jets looked like in 1967. The loading area was made to look like a NASA launch pad. Also, when you were getting in line, you had to take an elevator up to the loading zone. The elevator was also very similar to the elevator that astronauts took up to the launch pad. In 1997, they decided to refurbish it again, but when they did, unfortunately, the weight of the ride could no longer be withheld by... <laughs> by the building that it was on. It was relocated once again to the entrance of Tomorrowland so that it was the first thing you saw as you came in and it was placed on the ground level. It has been there ever since and it was renamed at that time Astro Orbiters and has that name actually still today. The ride was refurbished one other time in 2009 but there were just some minor color changes, no name change and no relocation or major refurbishments then either. We're on the rockets! Here we go. Here we go. Oh. 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 oh, it leans good. Oh, it does. Oh, I like how it leans. Oh, I lose my hat. We're going up. Right. Oh my gosh. Oh, it really leans. Go up high. Okay.
about the ride, I found that it was very interesting. I knew that I remembered from my childhood that the ride actually was up much higher and back here further in Tomorrowland. And now that it's up front, I was trying to remember more information about it. So I did some research and thought I'd share it with you. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.